Here's the explanation for the key game. The first thing you found was a key. Now the key is interpreted as your ego. So most people have a standard front door key or a Lockwood style key that opens up their house or alternatively a car key that opens up their car. And that means they've got a healthy idea of themselves. If, however, you manage to have one of those keys that's about this long and it's made of gold and it's got jewels all over it, you've got an inflated opinion of yourself. The house. Now, the house is interpreted as your own house or surroundings. So, if you've got a wood cabin in the middle of that forest, you've got a lovely place at home and you feel quite comfortable. And all of this can vary. I did have one response recently where a person, believe it or not, in the middle of the forest had a southern mansion like they had in Gone with the Wind, for example. And that would indicate that they've probably got delusions of grandeur. The water at the side of the house is interpreted as your sexuality. So... If you've got a stream out the back or a fountain, that's a healthy sexuality that's travelling along quite nicely. If, however, you've got, as one of uh, my pupils in one of my classes had, a surf beach, I'd suggest you're probably a little bit too much into sex. And alternatively, there was one person who had a a fairly horrible-looking pond with dead fish in it And you can imagine what that probably means. Finally, when you were lost, what did you do? This is fairly literal, this interpretation. When you come across a problem in your life and it could be a problem with your family, your friends, colleagues, work, whatever it is, what do you do when confronted with that problem? Now, there's... Most answers will fall into one of two categories. Those people who sit there at the crossroads and bed down until the following morning and then deal with the problem then. And then you've got the other people, probably a lot more of the other people than um, those that stay there, who push on. Now, this is interpreted as you would deal with a problem in your life. So... If you're like me, if I have a problem, I just push through. I would like, let me talk to him. I've got to talk to him now. And I'd go and I'd phone that person. However, if you're like other people I know, you may want to consult widely before you make that decision. So you ring everybody, what do I do? What do you think about this? You get the advice. It's a more considered decision, so to speak. So there you have it. That's the key game. Hope you enjoyed it.